Jeff here at Gravel Casual Bike Packing. This weekend's adventure takes us to Salem, Missouri. We'll be uh, starting here. We're gonna do about 25 miles today. Uh, some country back roading, some pavement, some gravel. We're gonna end up at Shawnee Max Conservation Area. That's where we'll be camping. We'll get loaded up and get started here. We got her all loaded up here. Let's just take a look at it. Guys, we're just getting uh, underway here. We're making our way through the city streets. Uh, this morning it's about 75 degrees. I think the high for today is about 85. It should be a pretty nice day. No rain in the forecast. Hey guys, about five miles in here. Um, haven't really seen any gravel yet. It's been a uh, highway and a little bit of a black top. Yeah, well, this chip and seal or whatever you want to call it. I'm out here on Highway K south of Salem. Headed that way. Hopefully find some gravel soon. Hey guys, I'm here at this old this old barn here. That's one thing I like about riding the country roads and back roads. You see a lot of these neat old buildings what, that what used to be. Used to be a, that was a pond there, maybe. Some kind of barn. Hey guys, still on the black top here. Hope to find some gravel soon. Um, driving down through here, came across this over here. Not sure what it is. Got some flowers behind it. By it. Looks like maybe they have somebody buried on the inside or something. I don't know. All out here by itself. Interesting. some gravel here looks pretty good haven't really seen too much wildlife this morning saw a few cows I guess that's not really wildlife but saw about five or six turkeys that's about all I've really seen so far Guys, it's been raining pretty good for about the last 30 minutes. Uh, pretty soaked, but the humidity is pretty high, so I was already soaked with sweat, so a little bit of rain won't hurt. Hey guys, halfway point for the day, about right 14 miles. Just have 14 more to go. Uh, I'm gonna stop up up here for lunch, find a spot on the side of the road. I got some stuff with me to eat. Okay, guys, I think I found a lunch spot. 
I'll just right here in the grass. One important piece of gear that I bring with me is this. It's made by Static B, called the P-Sheet. Pulls down to nothing, weighs nothing, perfect. I don't know if you guys can tell or not, but the road goes down and there's a great big hill. Probably can't tell on camera, you never can. Gotta love the Ozarks in Missouri. Came down another big hill, I thought I could make it. Started slowing down, started shifting, and I didn't make it. So it's a hike bike to the top. Been very close to Shawnee Mac here a couple miles ago. I'll catch up with you when we get there. Shoddy Mac. This is just the entrance. A couple of neat rocks here. One over there. Stop here for a couple pictures and head on down to the campsite. It's free camping here, so you can't beat that. Campsite used to be pretty pretty grown up. Uh, says no camping there, no camping there. So I'm not sure what I'm gonna do. I think I'm gonna wait till later tonight before it gets almost dark and set my tent up off to the side here somewhere. I'm gonna be up at the crack ass of dawn and get packed up and leave. Maybe I won't get caught. I don't know how how often conservation comes out here. What are they going to tell me to do? Leave? <laughs> There's an archery range over there. Pavilion here. The barbecue pit over there. Another barbecue pit. We just have a couple, camp a couple campsites right over there. Anyways, there's a big tree there in the middle. I'm going to set my tent up behind that. Kind of hard to see from the parking lot. So maybe that's a good spot. Hey guys, Jeff here. It's, uh, it's the next morning. Uh, last night was my first night stealth camping. I didn't get discovered, so I must have done pretty good. Um, heard a few cars come and go out of the parking lot here. Anyways, we got 25 miles today. Uh, about 1,500 feet elevation, shouldn't be too bad.
figure I'd stop and show you the, show you one of the, a couple of lakes here. Can't really see too much. It's foggy. There's like a jetty out there or a dam divides the two lakes. There's a dock. We'll walk down to the dock. to sit on. See, I'm not the only one here this morning. There's a guy over there on the boat ramp. Yeah, pretty foggy. Should burn off pretty quick today. in here um, still no gravel mostly highways and chip and seal there's a little bit of gravel over there but not the gravel we want We're at the midway point and climbing pretty big hills here this morning. Headed that way, gonna uh, stop here and have lunch. So pretty early in the day, but it's halfway, so it's lunchtime.
Yeah, that's why. Now what? I guess find a gap in the fence. guys about a mile and a half away from being done with this uh, been a been a great weekend trip nice little short in and out well, more like a loop but uh, nothing too epic but a lot of climbing a lot of gra some gravel roads a lot of blacktop but all in all it was a great trip probably I think it's around probably close to 50 miles Not too bad for a weekender yeah, um, if you like this, uh, don't forget to like and subscribe, and see you on the next one.